Hey everyone, and welcome to another Affinity Photo tutorial slash sort of walkthrough ramble type thing that I've been doing. The first one that I did on the Impainting Brush tool got a lot of hits, and I got some requests from people asking to do more tutorials, so I thought I'd follow it up with another one. Uh, this is another quick and easy one. It's one of my favorites. Uh, the program is amazing. As I'm sure all you are aware, I'm really kind of I'm over Adobe, so this is a really cool program for me. But as I said, we're going to be talking about lighting. So what you want to do is get your photo, just a nice photo of a rock, because rocks are artsy. Yeah, I said it. I'm owning it. Let's keep rolling. So then you go down to filters, lighting, click it, and then look at that. You've got this, you've got a source of light, and then it's yours to play around with as you see fit. You, the top one here stretches it, as you can see, inverts it if you go all the way, but it's, you can go that way, you can go that way, that way, I think that's pretty nice. The center one is the intensity, so you can make it, you can blow it out real easy, but I'm trying to make it look, you know, sort of natural, I'm sure you can play around with it. This one here will actually move the whole, the whole lighting source, so it kind of, it's replicating having a light source there digitally, which can be come in handy if you um, forget to bring a light. <laughs> then, uh, so I think I'm going to go like, like that. Uh, so yeah, these ones will also stretch the, make it wider, make it narrow, but it kind of looks, I think it kind of looks pretty bad if you go too narrow, you know, unless that's what you're going for. There might be some fun workarounds you can do. I mean, there's always the exception to the rule, but I'm going to go quite wide, like there, bring it back a little to there, bring it up just a little, might make that a little more intense actually there, bring it in, in a bit more, and then, yeah, um, there's all these here, you can play around with the light here, ambient, you can make it more brighter around the edges, but I think I'm going to try and keep it nice and nice and focused on the rock because, as I said, rocks are cool. I'm owning it. Um, then you just apply it. Look at that. It's done. Looks kind of like there's a street light or something there. It's pretty cool. Uh, I've used this on some other photos, like lighting up a car, for example, at night. It, there's a lot that you can do with it. I wouldn't rely on it as a replacement for a light. Obviously, you're going to want to do as much in the process of actually taking the photo. So you'd rather have a flash there than doing it all in post, for example, because it does look better. But I mean, this is a pretty cool little feature. That's that's not terrible looking. If that was, uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm not a big fan of editing. So yeah, I'm pretty critical, but I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. Like, it's all right, you know, it's all right. <laughs> Um, but yeah, if you guys have any other questions about that, uh, I've just tried to make this one quick. The other one was nine minutes long, which I don't really want to keep doing nine minute long tutorials unless you're actually getting something out of it. And I'm looking, I'm doing it again. I'm ramble. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try and do really short to the point videos from now on. So if you want me to quickly, you know, if you want to learn about any of this stuff, the levels adjustment, um, how to customize the toolbar, you know, you can add all all kinds of stuff. I have a request currently sitting in my inbox to talk about the develop persona. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to do that next, I think. So yeah, that'll be in the next video, which we'll hopefully have a link to in this video. But as always, thanks for watching guys. I really appreciate the feedback and let me know if you want me to do anything else. I'm always here doing this stuff anyway, so I might as well share it with the world, right? All right. Take it easy. Bye.